Hey yo, shout out to my nigga Mikey T, the movie star. We live on Report Car Radio, and it's your boy Benny the Butcher. Who were the first artists from New York to show support to the label? Mm. Man, I'm not sure, man. Like I said, I'm not sure. Because I know Smoke Dizzle came and showed you guys some love, dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, a lot of people came and, 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 and saluted and fucked with the boys. Pause. <laughs> a lot of niggas. <laughs> A lot of niggas did, so I really can't say because I really wasn't around when those niggas was, was doing that. You know what I'm saying? Wes was just, I told you, Wes, this, what I'm doing right now, Wes had this plan for me without me even knowing it. <laughs> but a lot of niggas, man. P came around early. Prodigy, man. Respect to the GOAT, man. P. Uh, who them niggas had? Man, them niggas had, niggas was around a lot of niggas. Like, yo, such and such just called me. I'm like, word. You know that nigga? Like, them niggas was doing shit, putting me on. Niggas was meeting Royce, oh man, I don't know, man. A lot of them niggas, man. Niggas fuck with uh, Griselda. That's what's up. Did you actually get a chance to tell Prodigy that the first record you did was the Quiet Storm joint? Hell yeah. I got to tell Prodigy the first record I ever uh, recorded on was Quiet Storm, right? I told you that? When I tell you that? Oh, I be knowing my shit, man. No, I be knowing the shit, because I ain't tell you that. <laughs> But I got to tell him this. This is dope, though, that I got to tell him this, this too, that the first time I ever bought an actual CD out the store, a tape out the store, a tape was uh, murder music. Like, I had bought bootlegs before. I ain't going to say who boot shit I bootleg. But that's the first time I went into, like, a Sam Goody and bought something. It was murder music. And I had, like, some money from my... uh for my aunt to go school shopping and shit. And I just went to go get a double up. I went to go get a double up to hit the block with, and I went to go get that murder music. Facts. I gotta tell P that. Dope. Did you get to have much of a relationship with him? Man, no, I didn't, to be honest with you. I didn't, you know what I'm saying? I played on my album, though. I played uh, P, Tanner Talk 3. He heard Tanner Talk 3. Oh, I'm going to post about that. That's dope. That's ill. Just think about that shit. But I played the album for him. I chilled with him. I never even got a song with Prodigy. You know what I'm saying? I've been around and we done kicked it. You know what I'm saying? All that. Mm. Yeah, Prodigy was one of the coolest rappers out, man. He was cool. Hell yeah. Niggas will tell you this, like, at a, for a point in time, like, he was, the, he was the best rapper in the game. That's what I was saying. You know what I'm saying? Like, real shit. You know, I actually went to one of his shows uh, just before he went and did that three-year stint, you know, mm -hmm. for the gun charge he got. Mm -hmm. Did you, your relationship, did you meet him at post-jail or? So when he came home. When he came home. So you never got, like, a chance to smoke with him or anything? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I know he was on his health shit. Yeah, he was on his health shit crazy and working out and shit, you know what I mean? But we was, we, we done, we done drunk beers together, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Me and Pete done drunk beers together. But more importantly, he got to hear Tanner Talk 3, man. I think this is the last question I wanted to ask you. We didn't get to go go over it. Uh, what did you want the people to take from Tanner Talk 3? Man, I just want them to know, man, that I want them to know where I come from. That's why I named it Tanner Talk. My block is Montana. I wanted them to know where I come from and what I stand for. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> and, 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 and a rapping ability is there. So as long as you know where I, what, what I represent and what I stand for, you know what I'm saying? And, and I'm just a solid nigga doing this. I'm from the old school. I was raised by the legends, you know what I'm saying? The real legends, the real goats. That's what I was raised by, so it comes out in the music, you know what I'm saying? So I just want you to know that about me, that I'm one of the real ones, A1.